The murder case of an entertainment industry veteran may have just taken a dramatic turn. A man authorities say is somehow linked to the death of publicist Ronnie Chasen killed himself at a Hollywood hotel Wednesday evening, just as police were serving a search warrant. Chasen was fatally shot in Beverly Hills after a movie premiere two weeks ago. Detectives have been tight-lipped about the case, but a preliminary coroner's report has drawn lots of speculation. What it did tell me was whoever did the shooting in this case was proficient in their art. They hit center mass, which is what you're going for in a kill. Gil Carrillo is a retired homicide detective. He says the preliminary autopsy shows five bullet wounds to Jason's torso, indicating the shooter hit a moving target with precision, something that would be difficult for anyone except a well-practiced marksman. On a still target, I don't know that I could hit, and I qualify, he's qualifying every trimester. I don't know that I could hit a shot group that, that good. So it's somebody that's proficient in what they're doing. Investigators have released few details, but say they have not received any word of threats being made against Chasen. Chasen's many friends in Hollywood insist that she was not mixed up in any shady business, but Carrillo says any business can get messy when there's enough money behind it. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.